Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 11 of Fruits Basket. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Okay. <clears throat> mm. <laughs> Oh God, Cody, don't do that. Okay. Do you have to retake? Hmm? Wait, hold on. I think I, I think I remember what this episode was about. Kinda. Because she did do it in the regular series, but it was something... I don't remember. Mm -mm. But it, I remember her saying stuff like that in the original. But, you know, honestly, now hearing last week that this show is getting like 63 episodes... I'm happy with it. They're doing the story like it's supposed to with literally everything, even though I haven't really read the manga. I would like to read the manga. I just don't know where I should start. I know some people say, no, 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 start from the beginning. But then at the same time, I might say, like, in the original series where that ish happened, if you know what I'm talking about after... All that, that I can't really talk about. So, what chapter is that? And then I could know, and then I could look. Or I'll just, like, flip through <laughs> on my phone until I get to a chapter where they're not talking about that situation anymore. But, I don't know. But then at the same time, like, I would know things already. And I think... I mean, because I've said with other series, like, I don't really want to personally read the manga because then if I know, then I got to keep, keep it a secret a little while longer. But I do that with my hero and I really want to know what's going to happen next. I'm like, mm, you know, I was like, and then I don't have to spoil. I can be quiet about it. <laughs> I'm on easy. Yeah, I smell me these here. <laughs> mm. uh, uh, yeah, like this, man. 
Yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Yes. Oh, yeah, this story. Because no one's ever going to like this.
Sure. Ugh. Here we go. Yes. No, Mommy G. Good boy. 
Well, those two are going at it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we know, we know. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you okay? <laughs> Jesus, you hit your head. You okay? Oh my god. Poor dog. Move your head, Bill, so you don't hit yourself again. No, oh, no, no. 
<laughs> no, actually he will. No, no, no. He'll, he'll be in high school. Yes, yeah, she did. Mm hmm <laughs> That means, that means possibly, maybe next week, we're getting that one of the Stephen Hart. <laughs> Please, like, no, no. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you gotta love Sugar A. I, I hated the main outfit from, from the original series. It just, uh, mm, mm. I don't know what to say about Sugar A. I love him, but at the same time, I feel like, mm -mm. Just, just stay over there, stay over there. No, just don't get arrested. Just, mm -mm. Relax, but I mean, it was sweet to see What's Your Face again. I mean, because I kept thinking, I was like, yeah, I know we're getting the Hot Springs episode. And I was like, I think she's going to be in the episode. And finally she was, so I'm really happy about it. It was such a good episode. Like, my God. Uh, and now Luigi and Haru are going to be at the same school again. Just mm, the memory they're coming. And I just hopefully, hopefully they do that ap that moment in, uh, in the next episode. Because that's one of my other personal favorite moments for Haru. And I remember, like, if, if it does come up, it's just going to be the funniest thing. Because when I was in middle school slash high school and I watched this show, I didn't understand the joke until I was an adult. I was, like, 20, 20 21, and I rewatched the show. And I got to that part, and I was, like, I rewatched that scene, like, several times. And I finally got it, and I was, like... Thank you, Fruits Basket, for that nice, interesting joke that I didn't understand when I was a little kid, but now as an adult, I completely, totally understand. So I'm really hoping that they do, they, they put that joke in, whether it's in the Japanese dub or it's in the um, English dub. I think it'll be really funny. But if they don't do it, it's okay. It'll always be in my heart. And it's a really very interesting funny scene because if you don't get it at first like uh, immediately somebody is gonna tell you like what he meant by that that moment and such but like just please it would be, it would be so good so so good just mm. even the scene when he, when you, <laughs> I'm pretty good about it now the scene where like Toru puts her hair down and she puts the ribbons in her hair and he's all just holding it like oh my god I can't <laughs> It's one of the many reasons why I love Yuki so much, and I, as much as I love Kyo and certain things, because like it, it's just as I always say, it's a love triangle, and it's just like I, I I can't go into certain things about what the end game of who she really ends with in the show, but it just it, it's making me think all those years ago when I was in high school between high school and middle school, and, like, I was always flip-flopping between who I liked her with the most. And in the end, about what happened, no matter how I was, how my feelings were, I was still okay with it, even till today in 2019. But, like, if we're getting, we're gonna get to that part, which I don't know how, what episode they're gonna do it on. Puppy, stop looking at my hand, you weirdo. Um, but we're gonna see it, and then at the same time, I'm gonna be happy but devastated, because of that, and I can't talk about that yet, but when we get there, that's when I'll be able to talk about it, but I mean, like, for Toru and Yuki, like, for shipping them, like, this was a really good episode for them. Same thing with Kyo and, um, Toru, because, I mean, 
for him to say like, yeah, I'm going to go. And then he smiles at her having hard eyes and being all lovey dovey. It's just so freaking cute. And then it's just like Yuki. Every single time when you look at Yuki, Yuki just, he looks just when really when he's with Toru, he just looks like he's in love with her. And it's just so god dang sweet. And I'm just like, ugh. And it hurts so much. Like, I love it. And I just, I love Yugi. I love him so much. Like, I, like, I might have to start reading the manga today. Just to, like, see what happens next. Because I, I have questions about Yugi. Like I said, I can't really go into spoiler territory about it. But, um, it's really mostly about, like, endgame things. But... Do I want the questions to answer today? Kind of yes and kind of no, but then I kind of want to cheat and just, like, look myself, but I ain't gonna know. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 11 of 2019's Fruits Basket. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchup Squad, and of course, I will see you guys all officially next Friday for episode 12. Bye, guys!